everybody! Hello, Hello guys. guys! This is Magilive, we're the Vasquez family, and in today's video we are going to be reacting to everything, everywhere, all at once. We've heard quite the buzz about this movie. It's yeah. It says it's got everything. People are saying it's got everything, so we wanted to see it for ourselves. So that's what we're doing here today. Uh, if this is your first time with us, thank you for joining us. And uh, it means a lot to us if you could hit the like button. It helps support us and just let us know if you enjoyed this video. Mm -hmm. And we'd love to hear your thoughts down below in the comments as to what you thought of this movie. If you've seen it already and if you think it should win an Oscar because that's kind of what people are talking about. So yep. we'd love to hear what your opinion is on it. We'd love to connect <laughs> yes. with all of you. And if you enjoy watching these reactions and you want to watch the uncut reaction alongside us to your favorite movies and TV shows, then you guys can check that out on our Patreon and support us on there as well as become a YouTube member on this channel. Ooh, and you guys yeah. will be able to sync up your copy of the film and TV show with us and it'll be like watching it with family. So yep. yes, okay, we've talked enough. We're gonna jump into <laughs> everything everywhere all at once. Here we go. This shot so beautifully. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. He's seeking a divorce? Mm hmm. She is? She is. This is Evelyn Wang is seeking a yeah. divorce. Mm -hmm. Character introductions. <laughs> Seriously. Mm -hmm. Hi, Becky. Thank you for coming. Please call me Wayman. <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway, my English. Mom, what? Mom, just wait, Ski, okay? I like Becky. She's very nice. You are very lucky. She's she to die like that. He's not gonna die. <laughs> That's not what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Hang up. Thank you. For you. No, I have the ticket. Don't leave my Hang up. Thank you. We've, we've been together for three years. Don't You know, two years of meeting, she puts a lean on our laundromat. Mm. And you know what? You're like, I can fight for all of us. What? What the heck? <laughs> what? Whoa. What is going on? <laughs> what? Dude, he starts moving like. I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know what he said. Oh, <laughs> I have something to say to you. You, you have to try and eat healthier. That is not what she was going to say. Yeah. <laughs> Part one. Oh. That's what she's thinking about. Oh this my goodness. so awesome how it's made. I've never... Yeah. I haven't seen a movie like that. She's thinking about everything. <laughs> The way this is shot, man. I'm sorry, it's a girl. Mm. Yeah, it's probably her youth. <laughs> she just relived her entire life. Uh, uh, no! <laughs> yes? <laughs> Could explain this. <laughs> These characters are so great. So she's supposed to follow those instructions, right? If she goes to the audit? Mm-hmm, yep. I believe so. Whoa. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm sure you have a lot of necklaces. I know you have a lot of things. funny. <laughs> I wanna redo, you're gonna resubmit? I will be in contact soon. I think my other husband's messing up the audience. Maybe we, uh, we can... No one! Whoa. <laughs> 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 Who makes it off? Oh, dear Lord. Who makes it off? Evelyn! Evelyn! Hey, 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 she was to what? Ah. 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 Stop call security! What are you doing? She was coming after us. Oh. That one right there, the Chinese lady. No, it's all his fault. Okay. 
Okay, I need you two to get on the ground with your hands behind your heads. I could hold it. Mr. Cocker, I hold it. Sir, please come by. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Dude, what? He's always got a like a great fanny pack. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> Chef steak. <laughs> what? <Sure. laughs> what is this? Guy? What is he doing? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh man! <laughs> He's just waving that thing everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> dude, they're in stupid. Oh. <laughs> These shots, dude. Wow. <laughs> The fanny pack. Oh. I need to get one of those. <laughs> what is he doing? Oh, he's adding weight to that thing. <laughs> oh, baby, it's going to get painful. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ow. 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 <laughs> Ow. Oh. oh. How? 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 How do they do that? I love it. I absolutely <laughs> love that this is nominated, dude. Dude, this... what the? Dude, On what the crap? Who won the light here? Oh my dude. god. Dude. 4,655th day the first. Whoa, she's ecstatic. He has seen all and all. She knows what makes you tick. You see her nails? Yourself. Mm -hmm. Whoa. The different multiverses or what? Mm -hmm. uh, oh, what? It's her daughter. Oh no. Her daughter is the other version of her, right? No, I think her daughter is the villain. Well, no, in the same way that that guy became her husband. Yeah, that's... The villain just has, happens to be another version of the daughter, I think. Every time the decision creates another brain... Oh my gosh. Look, universe. The first universe to make contact with you. Oh. Why does he have to be chewing something? That's a good question, eh? <laughs> Two guards coming this way. I'm a signal, trying to blend in. Dude, he is incredible, man. Incredible. I forgot what's going on! Hurry! <laughs> 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 Dude, it's so great! Oh my gosh. How did I... You're just making up sounds. <laughs> 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 no. Oh, I love this script. I finally understand why. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> she's, she's a bear fine. My gosh. <laughs> you can just think <laughs> somebody else. Dude, this is. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh man! Oh. Is that pro wrestling? She's going for a bath break. Oh no! <laughs> that Claire de Lune? She's got to run. I just no, heard Claire de Lune. <laughs> Also, without the head thing, he can't channel the powers. 
Well, she's usually so badass in movies with the fighting yeah, and stuff. Oh no, where is she going? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. This is so like exhausting. <laughs> <laughs> this is absolute madness. <laughs> what the heck? Oh my god. <laughs> it is Claire de Lune. Yeah. Oh my. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 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 oh! oh! She's. <laughs> this movie, dude! Oh my gosh, I'm like not breathing. <laughs> that little pink pig is so fun. <laughs> In the fanny pack. Yeah. Are you with me? <laughs> <laughs> I know. One of the many things we lost in our war against Jobu. Coochie. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> Is she walking a pig? Joy? <laughs> Why do you look so stupid? Damn. <laughs> what the heck? Whoa. <laughs> See, I can walk through you. Officer down. No, no, don't Hands up your Dude, what the heck? <laughs> 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 Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Such a weird oh <laughs> thing. She's using. Oh my gosh. Choose you to boot. Oh my gosh, dude. She can just change. Yeah, she's too. She has complete control over every. <laughs> Oh. oh my oh, no. god, what is that? She appears to be as hot dogs instead of What? Oh my god. And they can't play the instrument yeah. because of their fingers. This is crazy. Oh. Uh. Ew. Yeah, I would puke too. What is she gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Uh. This is such a like bonkers movie. What? On you too. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing here? Wow. Dang, dude, wow. this movie. <laughs> I bet you somebody. I bet you somebody was eating an everything bagel, and they just went, "What if you put everything?" I have this on under a bagel? control. Again, you deliberately disobey. I'll never eat everything bagels the same. Although everything bagels are my other favorite. Are my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> that movie. Okay, what are you talking about? The Matrix. Rakakuni. You know the one the chef. Oh, Ratatouille. And he makes bad food. Pui. This raccoon sit on his head. <laughs> oh my goodness. Dude, she actually didn't do it? Mom? Her spell. Holy shit! Holy shit, he has a gun! I think it's time for a family discussion! <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> I don't think now is a good time to dance! Where? <laughs> What the heck? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> that was so funny, dude. <laughs> the heck? Dude, where is this going? <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> 
She swallowed that. She swallowed that. it? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Dude, <laughs> what? <laughs> my goodness. Oh! 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 Man! Ah, oh, God. The choreographies, dude. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what the heck? I can safely say I've never quite seen anything like this. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no! No! Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I was just saying. Now she cares. Oh, oh my God! Uh. <laughs> this is like all her, man. I mean, she's... Yeah. Oh. They lost the connection. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, nasty! <laughs> oh man! No way! Oh, don't! Don't! <laughs> <laughs> no, dude. No what? way. What no. Are you kidding me right now? It's, is... it's improbable. Oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> man. I love how they try to help her. No. <laughs> 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 No! <laughs> oh man! Oh, dude! No! What? 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 Vicky is getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> I'm dying, bro. <laughs> no, he is not fighting. Come on! Get out of here! <laughs> Whoa! How is it able to move right now? Whoa! Wow, that really good. <laughs> oh! That's too much, man. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, man! This is ridiculous. It's too- it's too perfect, honestly. <laughs> 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 my head hurt. My eyes, bro. My head is hurting. I'm dying. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> We're supposed to sleep after this movie? Wow. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta unplug. <laughs> Gotta unplug, man. <laughs> unplug the power. <laughs> oh, nasty. There was like debris in the air. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Reaching mental capacity. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Pinky. <laughs> 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 Pinky gong. <laughs> oh my goodness, this movie is absolutely. <laughs> oh man, dude. 
nothing. I've never seen anything like this ever, <laughs> ever in my life. Automatically makes this cinema. <laughs> it's the wushu finger. Yeah. <laughs> the wushu finger hold. <laughs> the sound. <laughs> I need water, man. I'm not even breathing. Emma, I mean, Emma. This is too much. I think I'm like, my mouth is like... Oh, oh no! Oh, no. Am I getting it? Oh, <laughs> Uh-oh. Ew. Damn. You're kidding. No, it has to be fair. I don't Remember believe this it. Is part one? Part one. <laughs> she has to watch yeah, this. Yeah, remember there's everything everywhere. We're missing the everywhere part. Mm -hmm. She doesn't exist in this world. Rakakuni. <laughs> Circle mm. on the paper. Everywhere. Part two. <laughs> so that paper is everywhere. Mm hmm. Yeah, the, the, the bagel, the circle, that. Yeah. Thing yeah. The... Dude, what Whoa. the heck? <laughs> <laughs> so she's always been aware? What? It's the circle, dude. The circle from the paper. She's missing everything because she's so not present, right? <laughs> Whoa. Two rocks in the middle of nowhere. Okay. <laughs> this is so unique. This is the weirdest movie. <laughs> Just be a rock. <laughs> I can't even play that with my hands. <laughs> song the same again oh my gosh <laughs> put on some pants dude uh. <laughs> oh my god i love this <laughs> they probably had so much fun filming this dude <laughs> <laughs> He has everything in it, man. <laughs> the car sound. Whoa. I didn't even know how to get out. Kidding, dude. You're kidding me. This is remarkable. <laughs> this is. <laughs> dude, imagine filming this. I cannot imagine what this was like filming. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. <laughs> dude. <laughs> <laughs> The cry of the pinky. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Jemmy, you and me are gonna fight like that. <laughs> Definitely late now, guys. Uh, Do you have to bring all these? Mm -hmm. Now needs to go in the back, too. This is sucks. Yeah. <laughs> That's a man right there. Yeah. <laughs> Evelyn, did you hear me? Sorry. What did you say? Wow. Oh my goodness gracious. Dude, what a movie. Wow. <sighs> Look, oh, the Russo the brothers. Russo brothers. The Russo brothers produced, produced it. Produced it. Wow. Oh my day. Gosh. What a movie, man. What <laughs> Oh man. I do not exaggerate when I say I have never <laughs> seen anything like this. Yeah, there is nothing like this. I don't think yeah. I will ever see anything like this mm. ever again. It's so... Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> I feel like all these oh. crazy dimensions and different worlds are ways to, like, represent different lives and stories and people, but not directly. Just kind of giving you a an idea of what the message is without being direct about anything. <laughs> it's, just, well, it's... it's just like, like, even the donut, like... The bagel. Right? It's the complete the bagel. bagel. <laughs> Sorry. You see? I'm, I forgot I'm, already. The, I'm hungry. the bagel. bagel I haven't though. been yeah. eating bagels. So, anyway. Yeah. Just even that. Even the whole thing about the bagel. Just. My goodness. Oh, there's so much to say. Yeah. I'll let you guys go first. <laughs> Definitely going to take a bit to digest it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think initially, like immediately, this, like, cinematically with the visuals and the music. I and the shots, the music, like, the cinematography, oh it was just also <laughs> intentional, you know, and the Daniels, the, the duo, the, the director duo, they are, I felt like I was, like visually, some of the shots they got, it felt like I was going through their mind, like like what they envisioned, um, like no, no shot was... How do I even say this? Like they just committed. They committed to everything that they were doing. Like there's little shots of the editing. <laughs> That's man. What you said is, I've literally, I've literally seen the it. editing. The editing is insane. What is the first time I was ever introduced to this movie was a YouTube video about the the creators of this movie talking about how they did some of the VFX shots. But of course, when you have no context, you have no clue. And now it's like, and it's been so long since I've seen that, so I have to go back now to watch it. But Oh, we want to see that with you. Yeah, I'm gonna have to pull it up. But yeah. to be like, we remember when you mentioned that. Came visually, out last year, right? visually, it. Yeah. How do I even say? It? Like, it yeah. just extends how. It's a feeling. Yeah. It's like that that endless possibility every day of the choices we make, and and it just like just puts a finger on 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 it on the whole the feeling, the yeah. whole feeling of like like that moment at the end where she kind of like dozed off. And then she's like, hey, were you listening to me? And she's like, oh, no, sorry. Can you say it again? Yeah, it's it's just, it's genius. The way that also people check out of their daily life, like, you know, you can go through your moments and just be disconnected from the whole world around you. 
it's one of those movies that there was moments where I was watching it and I'm like, what am I watching? Like, this is ridiculous. Just the crazy things that were in this movie. <laughs> just, I was like, I can't... I can't imagine it getting crazier and then it got even crazier. But then the way it kind of takes you out of reality to all this craziness, but then it finds a way to like loop it back to something so powerful, such a strong message and such a dynamic story. In a beautiful way, it's almost, it's so peculiar and unique and so vivid. It's like, you're never going to forget it either. Yeah. It's like the message yeah. that they shared to you, like, this is something you're probably never going to forget. Mm -hmm. Just because of how vividly, figuratively they showed it in a literal way. It's just so impressive. It's such a universal feeling. I think we can all relate to just feeling that. Everything, everywhere, thinking of all the possible, you know, outcomes, where you could be, where you could have been. And I think the biggest thing I got was, and you saw it with the Chinese New Year party, was you realize like, oh shoot, she's been somewhere else this whole time. Mm -hmm. And she hasn't been present, fully present. And the one person that was present with her, and, and it wasn't even, they, they really were foreshadowing it and showing it with Alpha Wayman, the way he was coming in and always telling her like, pay attention to me, pay attention, be present with me right now. And it's, that's, that's what he represented to me was living present in, in each moment and, and living fully and, and selflessly oh and God, finding the kindness and love and, and all of it. Um, he was outstanding. Yeah. Oh, he was so good. <laughs> the three of them. So he good. Made me so beautiful All because the last time we've seen him in anything, I, that I've seen him in anything is in The Goonies where he plays a little kid, you know, Dada, who's got all this cool gadgets and stuff. And to see him now as a grown man and, you know, playing this character that's just so, such a, such a magnificent character and where his heart is and how he's, he's the light in the, char in the, in the story about, you know, to, look at things positively even when things are hard to look at positively you yeah. know just that that constant hope of you know taking every day at a time being present and everything it's just oh it's beautiful <laughs> do you see the genre of this movie science fiction comedy, comedy horror, horror and, and adventure, adventure. yeah <laughs> it's insane it's everything <laughs> i think <laughs> another thing too sorry really quickly i think in order for this to work they needed to have the contrast you know because you could make a a multiverse movie and but if you have a grounded story a grounded cast just everyone was so raw in their emotions and their reactions like those moments one of my favorite multiverses was the rocks oh yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah. besides you know the rakakuni but you know <laughs> um i no. i just loved that where you just see like just subtitles of what they're saying and then like Man, but yeah, that that those last moments where they were just so raw, you know, like uh, watching a real family go through something, you know, I think that's that's truly what like makes all of this just, uh, I, I yeah. And that beautiful sense of hope at the end too, because sometimes there's you know tragic tales where they teach you something, but then you know there's also a beautiful another side of it too, where you know there's hope that you know there's gonna be tough times, but it's just to keep keep on going. It's just constantly just changing that mindset. I think the way we view life, it's very, it's so eye opening. <laughs> it's interesting. It's interesting because, like, to your to your point of of hope, the way she was being in her reality, right, was affecting every other version of her. Every other version couldn't be present in the moment. And then there's that parallel with the beginning, with how the whole adventure started, with her looking to her right to the janitor's closet. What's in the janitor's closet? And that's how the movie ends. You know, there's that level of, you know, we're all going to have those moments of thinking about everything. And it's it's a choice to just live present. I think live presently in, in the moment in those small, the small everythings, you know, of thinking about all of it at once. We're just not, we're not meant to, to comprehend that and to get that. That's why I love the, the way, the fact that a, an everything bagel, which is by the way, my favorite flavor of bagel. <laughs> yes. um, yeah. It, the fact that they use that to personify that idea of just everything, you know, all at once is, is just so... Like you were saying, Mom, strange and bizarre, but yet it makes so sense. perfect, and it made sense. And I don't know the way that there, because you know sometimes stories are they, they make certain things happen as if it, you know, she's imagining all this, you know, and 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 in reality, what I loved it is that they they really stuck to what they were going for and made it very literal for the character and for the characters we were following. I mean, the three the three actor, you know, the three main actors that trio, Michelle, Stephanie, and K. We. Khan. I hope I'm not saying his name right, but father, mother, daughter, that, that trio was, oh man, they were all so good. They were all so good. Yeah. Yeah. 
really well, nice. it also made me. Re- I mean, I will. I'm sure we'll be thinking about this movie for days Ever. and weeks yeah. oh because goodness. there's so yeah. much there that you could connect to. But somehow, her like the apparatus of connecting to a different dimension hmm. made me think about like the way we connect with technology, right? To so many different things. And that, that that's what I kind of thought of when I saw like the hot dog fingers and the raccoons. And, you know, sometimes we spend time looking at really stupid things like as humans, like we just spend time and waste away hours of our lives, like just looking at ridiculous things and stupid things and other people's lives and other people's lies sometimes, many times, you know, where we're not present. And that that way to like connect, it almost in some way made me reflect on technology like well we're so caught up we're so sorry to interrupt that Mm -hmm. we're so caught up on what our life could be like you know what if i was this or what if i was that or you know Mm -hmm. that you're you're unaware we become unaware of how blessed we are in this present reality and the way that we are is the way that we're meant to be Mm -hmm. you know it's like even in those other lives there was something that she was always missing Right. You know, it's like you if you're constantly thinking about those outcomes, it's like you're never gonna see what you have. Yeah. You know, that's a that's a blessing here in your your reality, not just caught up in your fantasies. Yeah, like like you know, sometimes some people wanna be anywhere but in their lives, in their situations, in their you know, in their lives, in their families even some people. Because we're so disconnected and time does go by, it's just so many beautiful I mean, I could forgive all the wonky craziness because that's not, I'm not about that. <laughs> I, yeah. I get very like, what is all this? I'm sure, yeah, I made weird facial expressions through this whole thing. <laughs> but when you look at the deep core of what they're trying to portray and the story and the message and just all the underlying story elements, I thought it was genius. Right. Like my Like my hubby said, I have never ever seen anything like this and i don't think i ever will there's nothing like it because it's it's so many things at once and that's how you know it's twice and everything it's, it's film everything it's and i know i know dad has lots of thoughts and i know you cried a few times yeah i so. cried yeah, yeah i cried too i man. cried inside i'm not a very emotional person but yes there was a lot of beautiful moments yeah. that yeah i just i think emotional to, t- sure. to tie what to what you're saying because you know i think sometimes some for some people even for myself included, I think sometimes the reason I escape or I want to think elsewhere is because the the present moment is just so overwhelming, you know. And I know for for there's a lot of people where there's such a heightened sense to to reality and to certain moments where you take it all in at once, and and that is overwhelming. And sometimes the only way is to to escape, and it takes it takes energy, it takes it takes a lot of effort to to be present. But that's what makes it all. This story, it, this, it's it's yeah. just so like i think that the dad was just he was my hero yeah yeah he, he actually reminded me of of you love the mm. spirit of kindness the spirit of patience the fact that that's his true superpower that that's how he fights and that's what ultimately is the the game changer mm. sorry josh i don't know if you were done no i, I am done yeah <laughs> the fact that it's <laughs> Her daughter, Joy, is so sure in her arrogance and her stubbornness that, oh, mom, look at this. You tried to be empathetic and join me and try to feel my pain and you found nothing new. There is nothing new in the world because nothing matters except love matters. True love matters. Selfless love matters. I mean, he is the embodiment of the people in our lives that are meant to make us better. (laughs) That are meant to open our eyes, even our googly eyes. <laughs> and this movie is absolute literary genius. Yeah, it's... It is, yes, it is at times super, like, weird and bizarre. And at first you're like, what is all of this even going to mean? Does it even mean anything except for the joking part of it? <laughs> but every every end gets tied into this beautiful tapestry about family. Yeah. About what it means to truly love selflessly. And for me personally, on a, on, a, on a level of faith, I can relate to the very end moment of this movie. The noise never ends. What I love about this movie is that, yeah, it's like this poetic, modern, contemporary fantasy piece. Um, it's like a psychological tearing of your mind <laughs> and your soul. Humanity, yeah. But it lands us in this place of, of 
of grounded reality where the noise doesn't end, whether it's memories of great adventures or memories of nightmares within a, any given moment, I know I can relate with, there's always noise that robs me from connecting with my daughter or with my sons or especially my wife or friends or family. We get caught up in the noise of, you know, got to get the next job. Other and multiverses. Of all the different multiverses. Yeah, because we do get stuck, whether it's provoked by technology or by memories or heartache, mm -hmm. noise, it's just noise. Yeah. But to be able to even treat all of that with some sense of, of love and forgiveness and kindness, um, it is a superpower, you know? And yeah. I know my faith helps calm the noise and helps me navigate these waters. My relationship with God helps me yeah. see the multiverse and see all the many me's and teach all the many versions of myself to love better, to progress further with selfless love. And I'm not perfect at it. These people will tell you yeah. I am absent <laughs> all too often. And I work as hard as I can every day to be as present as I can. Mm -hmm. But this movie just hit all the right nerves of what, I'm, what I've been going through. And I'm just grateful for these artists, um, for their kindness, their generosity. Mm -hmm. I, know, I know every single one that's involved in this movie put their soul into oh, it. Oh, absolutely. Because it has... It has hit. And I don't know how many awards it's going to continue to win. It doesn't matter. It's it's really impacting lives. And that, I think that's what matters. You know, I read something recently that speaks about the presence of the great creator, our great God, that comes through. Whether, whether people intend that or not, the presence of God, the presence of actual, uh, of pure, true love comes through. And we receive it. And I thank you for it. Um, I, I applaud this whole crew and cast for what they've done um i'm i'm like hot in here i've been sweating thank you for this journey this and thank you that i i've got to sh i had the chance to share this with my family bravo absolutely flawless yeah, film, yeah. in my opinion and i'm thankful it didn't end on both occasions that i was afraid it would end the first time we saw credits i was like please does let this not be the end this is gonna suck and then the rock scene i thought the rock was gonna be the end so the, well, that's, that's just crazy. Ending, it, so. it, on a literary point, makes complete sense. That's the point where you would expect to for it to end. And and another point is like to add on to what you were saying about it just being literary genius. The fact that in order to uh, verse jump, mm -hmm. you have to yeah. do something that's so improbable in your universe, or something that your your mm -hmm. your your version would never do. And then you think about real life when sometimes when we put when we you know truly go into that unknown and do the thing that terrifies us that is so unusual that's so out of the norm so unconventional that that's that tends to be the breakthrough that tends to be the thing that sets you off to to be you know the next to continue to evolve and to just be the a better version of yourself and mm -hmm. again and the opposite can happen too the opposite can happen you can too. do something out of the normal yeah. that you know you make a choice or you decide to go with a certain crowd you shouldn't go with and and it just causes you to be part of some other you know some other place and you're just not present where you're meant to yeah, be you absolutely. know you get hot dogs for fingers yeah and you start playing the piano with your toes you know and, and if you just... can play claire de lune though it's not that bad of a no no <laughs> i i would need... but i see what you mean it's the, the consequences of the of consequences that. but also mainly what you're hitting on which is that there's certain things you know that we have to do to unlock like a part of ourselves that is just like you know yeah it's oh, man yeah but it really is about the family yeah all of it yeah you know um i i, I, I just say that's that's what we have you know yeah i think it's it's the, the the constant thing throughout every possibility that's the one thing that doesn't change and what? it takes work yeah it takes work it takes effort it takes perseverance perseverance yeah it's not easy yeah. to put family first and to be present as much as possible and Again, we're not perfect, um, but this story really reminded me of that. Like we recently saw, and I don't want to get into a discussion about the Red Panda, the Disney movie, it but the me of mother that, daughter actually. story. And we did have our thoughts about it being lazy as far as the 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 resolution between mother daughter the character and change. The yeah. character changes, the way that the characters grew good, and but, evolved. Yeah. And I'm not trying to be judgmental about the story. Some people loved it and that's great. But when you look at the difference of Yeah, compare the these way, movies. Yeah. The way this <laughs> movie really like 
it wasn't just I'm going to accept you for who you are and let's just live our lives. It was like, no, I'm going to look at my own life, realize why I'm so broken, what I've done wrong, and how can we see each other face to face, see truly where we are and who we are. And, you know, when she goes to that car and she's like, no, like, get out, we're not done. That's the kind of thing that I like, I love seeing that because mm -hmm. that's truly making that effort to like, make sure that we're not just letting this settle and be, but we're really fighting for family. And it does take a, a hard fight. It does take a lot of, you know, blood, sweat and tears. Mm -hmm. um, and I love to see a movie that does that. It goes all the way yeah. um, to really go to the core of how to resolve something that a lot of times seems like it's hopeless and broken. And there's just no way to fix it, you yeah. know? That scene where she's like, uh, you're fat, you have to lose weight. And she just didn't want to face that reality of, I have an issue with my daughter and I are not well. Mm -hmm. um, That's the easy thing to say, right? Yeah. yeah, it's the easier way to kind of escape mm -hmm. that reality. And even with her husband, like, he didn't feel seen. In the beginning um, of the movie, you have the googly eyes. Yeah. And she refused so them. She, she, yeah. Both times, she took down the googly eyes. Exactly. And so that's actually, I think, the, the cataclysm for this story. Yeah. You know? And I'm sure whoever sees it, you'll get something but... else from it. Like, yeah. I think it's just that beautiful of, yeah. as far as but, literary. But to your yeah. point, on a literary, on a literary level, yeah. literary Jeez. level, level, mm -hmm. level, listen to me, literary level. <laughs> <laughs> Literally level. I think the reason this movie did so well in terms of the story that we're trying to tell was one, the directors and writers, like there was no judgment towards the characters. These mm -hmm. characters just existed. Mm -hmm. and, and not even just like the main the family, the trio, but every single other supporting character was just so, oh my gosh, just so dense with, and yeah. dynamic with, with just character. And when you have these characters you throw in. When the grandpa accepted that reality, I got, a, I got emotional. Yeah. yeah. You know, because th there's there's that block, you know, he's got all of these these mechanical things on him, these claws, and he's just like, it's, you know, he's stuck in the path. But like when he truly opens his eyes, it, it, it's it's beautiful. Yeah. You know, to see to see that that love. It's just yeah. it's incredible. It's, it's yeah. yeah. On, on a literary standpoint, you have no judgment of the characters. You see them react authentically. And I think I, I would imagine the writers, you know, the, the Daniels have some connection to the to the piece that they wrote. Right. Mm -hmm. But there's this level of, how do I say this? It wasn't for them. Mm -hmm. The story was not for them. Mm -hmm. There's certain movies you see where it's, 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 it's for the, the artist. It's for their own either self, it. yeah, self assertion, self like to feel better about themselves, to, to assert what they feel, to, yeah, to affirm what they've done or didn't do or so on. You can fill in the blank. This movie was truly. In my opinion, and I think we can all agree, an act of service. Um, and I yeah. think the Daniels, the passion that they poured into it, they were able to somehow, you know, which I think is so important as artists sometimes to to step away as, as the creator, right? And see it from like a bird's eye view and just throw all these characters in, these all these different elements and to just let it happen. Yeah. And that's what this feels like. I mean, obviously, clearly all the colors and not, like, craziness. <laughs> But there is something so powerful and, and simple going on as well. And and that's why I think it'll just it'll stand the test of time because it, it's just a story that um, is timeless. That, that 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 idea of family, of family dynamics, of love, of just all of it, all of it is, is goes beyond just 2023, 20, 20, you know, the past 20 years. It's yeah, it's this is well, I mean, probably one of the the best movies i've ever seen yeah but yeah. um not, not to mention the like I, I know last year we were trying to gauge what were our, our favorite movies of the year but like if this this is this is it man. yeah, yeah being artistically like originality and somehow being able to give a love letter to like other different styles of 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 movies i'm sure they have a lot of fun making this movie man. oh yeah i mean and there's even like oh, nods gosh. to specific older like you know karate martial arts even movies sound you know, effects like, too yeah, oh, gosh, man. I, I want to. I want to make one final point, and then I will stay quiet. <laughs> this, I want to remind us all about the metaphor of mirror. It was the first thing we saw. It's the first shot. The mirror, and this whole movie, is a mirror on ourselves. It's it's glass breaking. It's different versions of ourselves. It's this whole thing makes us take a deep look at ourselves because by the end of it, as 
Matthew beautifully said, it's an act of service. It's these artists saying, look, these characters offered us a chance to look at ourselves. And so we're just going to show you what they what they taught us. That is the most pure art. And and that's why there's so many literary levels to this that we can talk about and dissect and analyze and grow from and learn from because it's it's infinitely connected to humankind to the human experience yeah and <laughs> it's it just it's just beautiful the how certain certain uh. elements to storytelling reappear there's a great filmmaker writer igmar bergman director swedish and he had a habit of always having mirrors in his films i don't know if the daniels ever studied or watched igmar bergman I have a feeling they have, but there it is. The continuation of these, of these, not just themes, but storytelling elements that connect all of humankind and give us these, these moments of feeling like connected and present. And, and again, thank you for that. I'm done. Yeah, yeah there wasn't, I mean, the, the, the theme and the messages are clear. Of course, it's like you said, something that you continue, you can continue to appeal, mm -hmm. but the story just said it. Like there's nothing that has to be, you know, like said aloud. In terms I of, don't. You know, that's it. That's it. And I'll be, I'll be quick. But basically, like I, the, you said earlier, this they, this was like an act of service, right? Like, yes, but they did us an act of service in having fun. Does that make sense? <laughs> yeah. Like they, I, I don't think that they were expecting to win Oscars making this movie. They just made this movie because they loved the story and they wanted to tell it. They needed mm. to tell it. And they have all of these fight sequences and these comedic moments and these, all these things that just make filmmaking like they're what makes filmmaking fun. Yeah. You know? I mean, <laughs> it's just it, it, it's it's incredible. It's like the the actors like the way that you know the, the way that the dad <laughs> was able to switch characters and you know fighting without pants and you know just yeah. just everything is just it's chaotic. <laughs> the 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 costume designers had a lot of fun making this movie. I yes. bet. The makeup designers with all the clown, you know, the 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 makeup and the just everything, every, the 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 fingers, the prosthetics, people, ev everybody was working on this movie. And I I would love to ask anybody that's worked on this project, but it looks like they had a lot of fun, yeah. and that just comes off. It does. You know, I feel like when you put so much weight of like reality, like all the these message, things, the yeah. message, and the yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the statement. You know, this yeah. is cinema. Like <laughs> certain things. Like just, of course, don't make a, a, a something carelessly, but really just put a lot of love into something. Yeah. You know, that's you, what's like, missing. You just, just you can tell that they just cared about this story. in other movies. In other movies, yeah. yes. it, it reminded just, me yeah. of um, like Joshi, what you were saying yeah. about Robert Rodriguez and uh, Spy Kids. Mm. <laughs> I remember watching Spy Kids, and I know um, his children or his son inspired the that was movie. Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Was Shark Boy and Lava Girl? Yes. That's some people. That was Spy Kids, Spy Kids. Okay. but Robert Shark Boy and Lava Girl is Shark Boy and Lava Girl was crazy too. And Spy Kids, there's a lot of imagination that they just went with to honor the story that they wanted to tell. And they didn't hold back. Like Robert Rodriguez did things in those movies that I, I used to watch and I'm like, I can't believe I'm watching Thumbs in clothes, <laughs> walking, like, you know, marching. Yeah. And just the things you see in that movie are just, <laughs> just insane. The, the, the faces and, so it did remind me in this movie, this is kind of that times a hundred. <laughs> but it yeah. was that it was like okay we have a story to tell we have these big crazy ideas but mm -hmm. we're gonna honor that and just just go just yeah. have yeah. fun it's that they they um, saw no limits they yeah. they they there there was no maybe there were i mean i would love again i would love to sit down with the daniels and, and talk to them about <laughs> the whole process of making this but there's this level of as an artist like respecting the vision you have right and not doubting it and just trusting Mm -hmm. And this feels like that. Like, not only did they have fun, but they just, if we want to see two men fight with butt plug, like, <laughs> like, like, if we, like, if we, if, if we can see it, then they can see it too. And we can make that happen. And to have that, I mean, there can, there's so many things that you could think of, like obstacles, like, oh man, this doesn't, it's not going to look right. It's, but there was such a determination. And like, certain Curtis. Yes, yes, like that's who I was going to bring up. Committed. She committed. She was mean, amazing. Dude, she... Amazing in this. Yeah. And can we talk about the fact that she was the killer in this? She, you know, she yeah. was the Michael Myers. 
as, as you know, it yeah. was like she had a chance to play this this role of, <laughs> yeah. of the villain, the you know the antagonist, the the, the force of evil. Yeah. Um, which scary. you know she became known for playing the victim of. Uh, it's just again so much poetic, beautiful. I said I was done. Yeah. I was in, yeah. Sorry. We no, could be okay. here. So we could be much. here for a long time. Yeah. Yeah. But no, this movie there's, there's clearly so much wow. we could talk about, and that's that's you know it's a good movie. Like some of the best movies. Or every time you see it, there's something new to, to peel back and to examine. And yeah, there's so much. Like you watch it once and you connect with, you know, Michelle's character. And then the next time you try to connect a little bit more with the daughter and, you know, you identify little things or the grandfather. Like, okay. like there are so many things that shock back to the initial time. And mm -hmm. man, so everything, everywhere, all at once. That was, that was our reaction. That was quite the experience. Mm -hmm. And, and we'll see. I mean, like you said, dad, I mean, clearly it's, it's already won awards, but. That's not what matters. That's not really. I mean, clearly, it's already. It's it's made. It's I do. I people have. You know, you have to hope that they get. They they know, better win yeah. something. Yeah. yeah. If they don't, I yeah yeah. This that's, is <laughs> this is what this is what filmmaking looks like, man. Yeah. You know I mean, this yeah. that's true. Just love. It's just love for the art. Yeah, and just diving into it and constantly pursuing some level of of excellence. And for that, and the Daniels, we haven't. This is our first project that there's that we've seen, I believe. Mm -hmm. Um, but. I can imagine that everything they've done before this has built up to this. You know, it's this constant progression and, you know, evolution into becoming, you know, just telling telling better stories. And it's just, it's great. It's inspiring. It's motivating. And it's it's moving. It's moving. And it's it's just so, so great. So, again, thank you to the Daniels, to the whole team behind this movie, mm -hmm. the actors, the cat, everyone. Um, <laughs> For just gifting us with this this experience and this beautiful work of art and yeah. yeah so so thank you and let us know down below in the comments if this movie meant the same to you uh, what your thoughts were on it and and yeah what, maybe what, you were squinting your eyes thought. as we were getting emotional and you know yeah or maybe what? you know you, there you, there was something with this movie that you just it just didn't click with you so let us yeah. know if you if you, maybe it didn't yeah. click or maybe it clicked, it clicked in all fine. the right ways right you know? but yeah. yeah we just yeah. want to hear it all we'd love to connect with all of you in the comments. And yeah, guys, just thank you for joining us today. And remember, you guys can check out uh, our Patreon or become a YouTube member to check out more mm -hmm. of our uncut watch-along reactions where you can watch movies like this with us nonstop. You can sync up your copy of the movie or TV show, whatever it is that we're watching, and watch it alongside us. And it'll be like you're watching with family. And we get to experience it together. Yeah. Uh, so, so yeah, but besides that, you guys, go out there, spread your light, and have a magical day. Bye. Bye.